I cannot express how much I hate potions class. We, we had to make a vat of liquid luck, and if you mix the formula in the wrong direction even once, the entire cauldron explodes. Sounds like a skill issue to me, Obamna. If you spent half as much time in potions as you do on this stupid Obamacare idea, maybe you wouldn't suck so much. Oh, fuck you, Donald. Oh, shit. Someone get over here. George? George, what happened? I found him like this, guys. He, he isn't moving. Are you sure he isn't just sleeping? This isn't exactly the first time we found him like this. No, this is different. See, his face is completely frozen with fear. Maybe he saw his approval rating. Whatever the reason, we gotta get him to the hospital wing. Right now. Man, this is terrible. It is. He, he doesn't deserve this. Huh? Oh yeah, that too. Wait, what? Sorry, I just realized that Slytherin is winning the House Cup by 200 points. Oh yeah, I guess that does suck. Well, guys, I got some good news and some slightly less good news. The good news is that there is a giant snake going around Hogwarts and paralyzing all the mudbloods, which I guess is what happened to Joe. How in the hell is that good news? The less mudbloods in this school, the better. You are unbelievable. What's the other news? The other news is that our exams have been canceled due to the attacks. Well, that sounds like a reason to celebrate. I'll go get us some butterbeer. So let me get this straight. You're completely fine with a giant snake terrorizing the school. It's only a matter of time before someone gets seriously hurt. I think you're overreacting, Obama. This won't last forever. In fact, it'll probably pass right by us, just like 2020. I, I should have left you in that forest, Donald. Hey, hey, guys, I got some bad news and some even worse news. The guy who usually makes the butterbeer was also paralyzed. Oh, well, that's not so bad. And so was Professor Garlic. What? That's it! The snake has gone too far. We gotta do something. Well, I actually agree with you on this. We don't know where it is or how to stop it. All we know is that it seems to be attracted to muggle-borns. Hey, fellas. I don't suppose there's any room for me in this episode, seeing as I've been released from Azkaban and all. What? So all I have to do is stand here in this hall with a blindfold on and I'll be able to join your merry band? Absolutely, Bill. This will be easier than lying to the public about my affairs. And I can do that in my sleep. I'll be honest, I don't think this is going to work. Of course this is going to work. You want to know why? Because it's my plan and my plans always work. We're so fucked. Hey, I think I hear something. Tisk tisk, another mudblood where they don't belong. I've already paralyzed three of them today. I feel like I should give them a break. Plus, I don't want to strain my eyes. For Joe. For Professor Garlic. For me. Ow. Oh shit. Okay, I'm gonna eat y'all. Run. Hey guys, am I allowed to take the blindfold off now? This is your fault, Obama. This was your idea. Well, why didn't you talk me out of it? Ah. ah. Well, shit, what do we do now? Hey, what about this sword? George, where the hell did you get that? Oh, the hat gave it to me during the sorting ceremony. I've been using it as a coat rack. Well, don't just stand there. Shish kebab the damn thing already. Hey-ya, hey ya hey ya ah! You missed! It was three feet in front of you, and you missed! If this is the end, Obama, I want you to know that I never liked you. Feelings mutual, Donald. I'll see you in hell. What? Not to fear. The Bidenator is here. Holy shit, Joe. Where did you come from? And, and how were you cured of your paralysis? P -p paralysis? I just fell asleep in the hall and, and woke up in the hospital wing. Ha! Told you Sleepy Joe wasn't paralyzed. Well, guys, I'd say a mission was accomplished today. Let's go celebrate not dying. Hey, fellas, is everything okay? Am I allowed to take off the blindfold now? Guys? My fellow Americans, please consider leaving a like on this video and remember to subscribe. And subscribe, remember to subscribe. That was my fucking line. And Ann, you took it. You were You always have to insert Obama. yourself where you don't you belong the and it's getting on my nerves. This is why you were unelected. I can't fucking believe you have zero common decency.